Sean, recently we've seen uh, the, the ECB's plan to, to join football in a social media blackout over the course of, of this weekend from Friday until Monday. Just how, how proud are we as a club and as a sport to be involved with this? Yeah, um, I think for cricket to stand shoulder to shoulder with football is, is excellent. Um, and all sports should be encouraged to be part of the social media blackout. Uh, I'm absolutely delighted that Leicester Shearer is supporting that campaign as well. And for me, there is no room in race, uh, racism in sport, on social media, in any walk or shape of life. So for me, this is a great statement, a great opportunity for all of us to actually sort of say, enough is enough, let's stop this, let's move on, um, and we'll have this blackout uh, to make a statement going forwards. Having worked in football previously, you may have been, you may, you may have come close to particular situations where a player or a member of staff has been subject to this abuse. How how affect how much sorry does it actually affect the individual? It does. I've seen it. Uh, I've seen it firsthand. You know, working in football um, and personally, I've had some abuse online, and, and it happens, and it affects people in different ways. Uh, but there really is no place for it. There's no need for it. We understand constructive criticism um, but we want to be positive we want to develop we want to progress and as here at Leicestershire we encourage our fans to get behind the team to bring them down we're all human beings so be positive be positive if you want to criticise constructively criticise don't make it personal don't, don't, don't make it about race or disability that's not right you know this is about um, a way of communicating and communicating the right way. And how important is it for, for sports across the, the scope of, of the world of sport to, to join together in solidarity to enforce that this message actually gets through to those out there? Yeah, I think it's incredibly important. I think sport is, is a great way of, of communicating with a, a huge audience. And it's great to see football take these measures and now cricket and I know other sports are getting behind it. So for me, I think it's, it's a great opportunity to really get across an important message. And finally, obviously, it means that the, the upcoming fixture against Gloucestershire away at Bristol that starts on Thursday, only half of that, just less than half of that game will actually be on social media. So just how can the running foxes follow the rest of that fixture? Yeah, good point. Um, obviously, with a, with a blackout means that um, our social media channels will uh, fall away, be very quiet. So... Our fans will be able to watch the streaming uh, through, through the website. I think we'll be issuing the match reports as well. So they'll get a bit of information, but there'll be little or no interaction. Um, so yeah, I'd encourage our supporters just to, to log on and follow the, website, follow the website and the streaming service.